Mamlaka ya barabara kuu nchini Kenha imeanza kupokea maoni kutoka kwa wananchi kuhusu ujenzi wa barabara kuu kutoka Garissa hadi katika mpaka wa Kenya na Somalia kupitia miji ya Daadab na Liboi. Barabara hiyo ya kilomita 211 inatarajiwa kuimarishwa pakubwa hali ya usalama na vile vile kupunguza visa vya magaidi kutega vilipuzi ardhini kando na kuboresha biashara katika nchi hizo mbili kulingana na meneja wa mamlaka hiyo katika ukanda wa kaskazini mashariki Huntington uh, Kid, Kidagasi Kidagisa ni weradhi ujenzi wa barabara hiyo unatarajiwa kuanza uh, na utaratibu wa ujenzi wa barabara hiyo utakapokamilika and we also have the the Asia and RAP experts who are also doing the resettlement action, action plan and the Asia for the project in preparation for the tendering to the contractor. Their inputs are the ones that will give us the project cost estimates for the construction phase. They started in August 2024. It will run for 18 months. So we expect it to, to be complete and we have the designs and the BQs ready to tender by end of 2025. That is next year. Hivi nyuma tumepoteza askari wengi ambao wamewekewa vilipuzi kwenye barabara. Na hii barabara ikijengwa iwekwe lami itakuwa inapunguza sana e, matokeo ama matukio kama hayo ambayo e, tume, imetufanya tumepoteza e, walinda usalama wetu kama nchi. Na pia itaimarisha biashara kati ya Kenya na Somalia. E, matembezi pia kutembeza kwa watu e, E, mifugo be, biashara na, na itaongezea yale mengine ambayo faida ambayo analetwa na hii barabara kuu ya Lapset. To open the entire project. The project is being sponsored by the Horn of Africa. You can imagine we'll be doing business with Ethiopia, with Somalia and all around that area. And you can imagine that kind of money that's going to get involved and it's a manner actually that came from heaven. Ni baraka imefika kwetu for the first time. This area is going to be opened and it's an a3 it connects hata tukipata security even our military had 